what exactly is fostering? Fostering is providing a temporary home for these kittens that are scared, older cats that are needing a break, bottle babies as you've seen in other Facebook lives. Um, it's giving them a chance to recover and get prepared for adoption. Great. So why is fostering important? Especially this time of year, we're seeing hundreds of kittens, um, applications daily for more kittens that are found. So fostering allows the shelters to take more in, especially like the Hermitage. We only have so much room to be able to house litters of kittens. So having fosters, we can get, if I have a foster home, those kittens can go to the foster home. It can also help socialize these kids that are super scared and otherwise would just hide in the kitten room and nobody would see them. Um, it is extra important to to just be able to give them a chance for a few short months or weeks even so that we can take in more. Neat. Um, are there other, other than kittens, are there other types of cats that fostering helps too? We do. There are adults that need the same thing. Um, we have Newfoundland who is in our lobby who actually went out to foster care because he was just hiding in a cubby for a while. And we were wondering, was that just him? Was that just the environment? He went out to foster care, was in a foster home for a few months, and now he loves to greet everybody. So it makes a huge difference, with even adults. Great. So how do people go about becoming a foster? So to become a foster of the Hermitage, you go to our website and you fill out the application. Once the application is complete, we'll do a background check. We usually do a little bit of a phone interview to find out more about you and you'll get scheduled for a foster orientation. Pet orientation will go over all of our processes and procedures, and you'll sign the contract for fostering, and we'll go over the kinds of foster opportunities you are interested in and what our needs are. Great. So after they complete the orientation, the application, what happens next? As kittens come in, or as medical tells me there's an adult that needs fostering, we'll contact you and I reach out and ask if you're ready to foster. And we'll get you scheduled for to come into the in-state lobby for a pickup. Great. Um, so what can our fosters expect when they come to pick up? What kind of things do we do for them? We will supply all of your supplies, whether it be food, litter. I have toys i have litter boxes we don't want our fosters to have to buy anything for their fosters we want you to provide love that's the number one thing a medical is available by our personal cell phones anytime so if you think there's an emergency if something you know doesn't seem right with your kitten or older cat you can reach us and we will be there for you that's awesome um so do they bring them for appointments? Like, how do they go about, kittens need vaccines and everything, and sometimes the older cats may need some medical care, so. And we schedule all of those appointments with you. Um, we work with your schedule and ours for you to bring them right back to this lobby for vaccines or for weight checks. Sometimes the older cats, we're checking and monitoring their weight, so. Oh, and I did forget, we also handle all the adoption stuff for, we you do. don't have to find adopters for your kittens. Hello older cats we will handle all of that stuff Great. which is a nice load off it's a stressful yes it can be very stressful for fosters to have to find problems for every every kitten that comes through